Thursday, August 31st, day number four on the trail. Let's hope it's a good one. I've left the John Muir Trail behind. I am now on the Pacific Crest Trail, the PCT, and I'm about to meet up with Crabtree Meadows again, and I have to cross Whitney Creek for the second time this morning. My feet are just now starting to dry out from the first crossing, and now I have a second crossing. So my morning is going to be full of frozen toes and wet shoes and socks. You can tell we're starting to get to water. So the trail is all the way up that rocky slope. You can see it starts right down there and it starts to wind its way up that slope. That's gonna be fun. I'm now in Guillot Flat. Some people call it Guy Out. It's Guillot. It's very windy today. Yesterday afternoon, I saw plumes of smoke to the west from a wildfire. And I'm hoping that the way these winds are blowing, it's going to blow it away from me. And that, right in front of us, for me, is Mount Guillot. I just saw a coyote run across the trail in front of me. I happened to be sneezing, and he heard me, so it spooked him, of course. What prize he left. He or she, I'm not sure which. Day four has come to an end. I have done eight miles and thousands of feet up and thousands of feet down. And I'm here at Rock Creek. And home sweet home, kitchen, recliner, all of the above. I'll be making dinner probably in about three hours. I have sent a message I've done my laundry. <coughs> I had to cross three rivers today, which means all of my stuff is or was dirty and wet. Now it's just wet. Because I've good afternoon, Mrs. Shadow. I've just washed my laundry. I am so tired. I am exhausted. I'm beyond exhausted. <clears throat> Just setting up my tent. I had my lunch, late lunch. Tuna, Fritos, and flour tortilla. I know it sounds gross, but out here, when you are burning thousands of calories every day, I will tell you, it's windy too, very windy. I will tell you that, jeez, oh, take that wind. Um, pretty much anything, <laughs> any combination that you care to put together will taste amazing. I've been eating peanut M&Ms with watermelon flavored sour gummies. Yes, it tastes amazing. This morning I put 
two packets of instant coffee and two packets of sugar into my water bottle, which already had some electrolytes in it. Oh, it was the best. I know it sounds gross, but it was fantastic. And this one, I don't know, decided I want to go this way, but I know I want to go that way. <clears throat> hey, you know what? Whatever floats your boat. And there's a lot of deadfall out here. I made sure that there's no dead trees over my tent. This one fell right into the river. Well, again, it's not a river. It's a creek, but yet it's a river. And I had to cross this creek about a mile down and I got wet up above all the way up to over my knees. And if you've never crossed a river slash creek when it's flowing like this, which is pretty hard because there's a lot of snow melt, <clears throat> you need to unbuckle your backpack, the bottom, the hip belt, and the top chest strap, just in case you happen to fall in. You can get away from your pack before it takes you down and drowns you. So, yeah, there's that little piece of advice. All right, I'm going to go sit in that chair that has my name on it. I know my name is not Helinox. <laughs> and I've already set up my bed for tonight. Pillow, air mattress, quilt. It's probably gonna be cold because it has not been hot at all today. So I have a feeling there's a cold front coming in. So it's gonna be chilly. And no, I didn't bring any chili. <laughs> 